Hey guys, what is up? And I welcome each and every one of you to a new League of Legends video. This is going to be a very special one. Uh, my editor actually pointed this out to me. So there's a bug with Twisted Fate that's actually arguably game-breaking uh, because you can proc with only Twisted Fate. You can proc energized effects two times. That includes things like Fleet Forward. Let me show you guys as an example, right? So check it out. We're at 100 stacks from, you know, Fleet Forward, right? It's ready to proc. You auto. Press W. You can take your time, select your card. It doesn't matter which one. And look, I'm still at 48 and it procs again. Like I wasn't at full stacks and it procced it again without it being back to 100. So it's literally two in a row, watch. So we're gonna wait for this one to get to 100, the first one. Auto. Okay. Auto. Again. Right? You can see that the effect comes twice. And this works with like static shift. This works with all energized effects. So you can, you can literally take all of them. Uh, and, and this works completely fine, which uh, is a little bit questionable. Watch, if you take all three of these, right? So watch, we're gonna walk over here. We're gonna have 100 stacks and check it out. Auto. Lock in the blue card, doesn't really matter which one, right? You can see the effect comes to me, the energized effect hit it twice before it got stacked twice. So you can literally burst someone really hard with a double auto attack effect, just like this. Boom, that's it, two in a row, right? It's a pretty, it's it's literally a bug, it's kind of game breaking, it's pretty broken, and yeah, uh, this video, we're gonna show you guys some gameplay of that, and let's, let's play it, I guess. Let's see how it actually feels in an actual game. Let's get right into it, let's go. If you enjoy, don't forget to hit that like button, by the way. Alright guys, so yeah, busting out Twisted Fate for this one, playing the Magnificent Twisted Fate skin, because is there any other skin to play, let's be honest here. And uh, yeah, we're going to be testing it out in a real game. We have Energized Effect, of course, from the Fleet Footwork, again, auto into a W throw, right? Um, I'm going to try, for the sake of the video, I want to try doing like a Quadra Energized Effect. Normally, you wouldn't do this, you would go like Triforce if you're going AD, obviously, you know, roll if you're going AP. But we're going to be going for Quadra Energized, so we're going to be going for the Static Shiv. Uh, the rapid fire cannon. We have the fleet fork, which is one of them as well, and of course uh, the, the storm razor, I believe, as well. So, yeah, let's see how it works out. Let's see how it feels. Let's go. Let's do it. Okay, so in case some people were wondering um, if this is just a visual bug, right? And, I mean, I'm sure some people are thinking that it is, right? So watch this. Look at the movement speed. I attack once for the initial proc, 402. Throw another one. It hasn't been fully stacked yet, 200, and I had another oh, 402 movement speed, right? So it's not like a visual bug. Like you are getting both effects. Oh, there's no bone playing. I respect him. Give me the movement speed. See, the double movement speed, baby. End up kiting this Akali. Beautifully. Use the first movement speed to get into range. Right? Of the Akali properly. And then you just throw the other one. Get the movement speed again. And then you use that to run away. It's, it's like the double whammy. Yikes. You know what? I don't want that cannon anyways. Don't want that many either, actually. Oh, she has cleanse. Yikes. Sure, I guess. <laughs> well, she, I think she was like trying to busy, uh, she was busy pinging. She was busy pinging maybe my, my, uh, my, uh, flash and ignite probably there, you know, and then as she was doing that I just threw the gold card I, I saw the opportunity to strike and Dude, we, we take those opportunities boys. Take those. I mean if Nocturne is actually trying to do something, I will TP Well, whatever we got a flash I guess we take those we take those so now we're gonna go for the Kirchner's Shard because this gives us um, the extra damage, right? It's 80 damage times two essentially, which is pretty powerful. So this is where we can start slowly abusing it. I mean, you can probably even go it as your first item if you don't have enough gold for the BF Sword first, right? You can go for this instead. It's a lot cheaper, naturally. Um, it's pretty good too. Goodbye, universe. It was nice knowing you. Goodbye, universe. It was nice knowing you. I mean, that's what happens when you're TF and there's two uh, assassins that have half map dashes, I guess. Ult in four seconds. We should be able to win this once I get there. Is that the energized TF boys? Reporting for is that the is that the energized twist of fate? A bug abusing monster himself reporting for duty? I think it is. I wanna go ahead and say that it is. 
I mean, I have flash ups. I'm not too worried. But those might be my famous last words, let's be honest with you. I'm just gonna reset. You know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna reset. I'm just gonna get out. I'm actually playing with fire here. I have 2,500 gold. I think it's smart to just not push our luck before these guys both press the R button and I die across the screen. I guess we'll go for this. Yikes, dude. Dude, the center is actually... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Our boy's here. Yo, welcome. Oh, no. He's... Okay, whatever. Dude, that center just made me lose two kills. It's so weird. You wouldn't think that, you know? It's like, the heal's not that crazy. It's just a little bit of a heal, but that was literally enough to make me lose two kills. That's crazy. Okay, now we have the double static shift. This is where it gets a lot more obvious that it's uh, a double procs. Because with the Storm Razor and with the Fleet Footwork, it's not as visually obvious. But now when you get Storm Razor, it's much more visually obvious that it's a double procs. So now you guys will see, like, when I clear minions, I throw an auto attack, energize effect for the Storm Razor, or uh, the static shift goes through, like, you know, as much minions as it can. Throw a W, it does it again. Like, watch this next wave. I'll let them group up a bit, and then we'll do it. I'll wait for the cannon. I'll throw an auto attack on the cannon, and then I'll throw a W on the cannon. Watch. Right. Oh god, I'm dead. Auto attack? Auto attack. Oh yeah, juicy. It also works on towers, that's the best part. Watch this. Auto attack, W, auto attack, right? Double electricity on the tower and everything. Like it works on pretty much everything in the game too, which is, I think what makes it even spicier and cooler to use. Really, really cool stuff. And now we're gonna work towards the rapid fire cannon so we can get that long range cash potential, which is just good in general on TF, regardless of this build, I would say. Just a very nice underrated item for uh, Mr. Twisted Fate. Blue card, salute. Never mind. Let's get the dragon. Nice and slowly, summoners. The fact that she almost got away from that is pretty ridiculous, I think. Is Nacho not coming to check again? Is he actually giving it up? What the f <laughs> I am a goner. Yeah, there's a Darius. My my static shift actually ended up getting me a kill in that team fight. <laughs> I have no mana. Oh, I got her. That's all actually killer. I got him too, don't worry. Wait, she lives? Wait, the bleed didn't kill her either from Darius? What? Wow, that Thresh Shield needs nerfs, apparently. <laughs> oh, that's big. Pew, 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 pew. Machine gun.
The Morgana Bonnie, where'd they come from? And out of nowhere, it just came out of nowhere, it just hit me. GG's, there you guys have it, the gameplay of the Energized Effect, let me know what you think about it. I still think going these specific items for this game is kind of troll. I think you should go maybe one or two with Triforce, but yeah, let me know what you guys think.